Hello there, welcome to Klein Farm Channel. Tonight I'm going to be making a homemade hamburger helper that is really good and it's it's very cheap to make and it's almost better and cheaper than buying the actual box of hamburger helper. And like normal, I started making it before I even thought about making a video about it. But here I'll catch you up on what I did. I have a pound of 7327 hamburger in here and I have a half of an onion diced up I have a half of a very big bell pepper diced up and I have a um, medium sized tomato I cut up into little pieces whole and put in and I am browning it now I have it cooking on a little bit more than medium this is going to end up being uh, like cheeseburger macaroni, pretty much. Then here are the spices I'm going to put in. Salt, pepper, oregano, gourmet burger seasoning, magic blend from Haas's Steakhouse, Montreal steak seasoning. Very good. Now, a lot of people like to drain the grease, but I don't. I personally, personally like to keep a little bit of the grease. If there's a whole lot of grease... I will drain some of it out but like if there's so much that you can't scrape it off the bottom yeah I'll drain it out but like what's in here now is okay regardless of what the mainstream media tells you and everything grease is very good for your body and it helps it helps your body expel and clear everything out yeah, get some of this grease out though good way to do it is to step up uh, paper towel in there and it will absorb all the grease and just pick it up and go throw it away Put some salt pepper some black pepper is best oregano Weber gourmet burger seasoning Montreal steak seasoning and some of this Haas's steakhouse seasoning it's mainly garlic and stir it all up real good put in some great value elbow noodles Got some more I'm going to put in too. A little bit more of them there. That'll be good. That all stirred up. And add some water. That'll be good. And just stir it up, make sure all the noodles are down below the water. And put the lid on, let it sit there on about medium heat for a little while. And then come back periodically and check on it, stir the noodles. I just love the colors, this looks so, so nice. It's going to taste really nice too. It smells so good already. Then you want to add a little bit of milk to it. Just a little bit. Might have been a little bit too much. But that's alright. Stir that up real good there. Needles are starting to get a little soft. I'm going to put some triple sh cheddar in here, shredded. And some Italian style cheese in it. Mainly mozzarella, but Parmesan, Provolone, Romano, Fatino, Nasiago, and a whole lot of Velveeta. This is also a good way to get rid of all the almost empty cheese packs you have in your refrigerator. That's it. And this Italian style. Now stir that in pretty good there. Mm 
it's all melted up. Then open up your Velveeta. Now I know some people don't like Velveeta, but to me it is liquid gold. It really is. I love Velveeta. Get a good block like that, then just cut it up or rip it up into smaller pieces and throw it in. Velveeta is real cheese to me. I bet you that what you cooking lady would even like this. I am very proud of this recipe. And just stir it up, let it melt real good. You can cut it into smaller pieces too, that'll help it melt quicker. But Bigger pieces like this, they melt too. This takes a little bit longer. But we're not in any big hurry. I'll just turn the temperature down from medium to about in between two and three there, close to low. As it is almost done, this needs to thicken up a little bit and let that cheese melt a little bit more. I think I'm going to add a little bit more Velveeta to it. And I cut these pieces up a little bit smaller. So it'll melt quicker. And just let it melt in. Put the lid back on for a few minutes. Let it continue to thicken up. It's real cheesy and gooey now. It smells so good. I made a few slices of buttered white bread for to go on the side with it. Because that goes perfect with Hamburger Helper. Now it's all done, really good. Let's start plating it out. Alright, let's give it a test bite. That is absolutely perfect. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Have a great day.